This is uh, Dana, and Dana's gonna put fuel in the helicopter on this rainy day. I'm getting rained on to make this video for people who wanted to see the helicopter get fueled. Let's see, so if it's a ladder in place because the tanks are up, up kind of high. He's waving. Uh, he has already grounded it. There's a grounding strap goes from the fuel truck to the helicopter. That's where we prefer to get grounded so it doesn't bend up our muffler pipe. He's pulling the hose out and it's pouring on me. And it's going to be pouring on him, but he's wearing a raincoat and I'm not. Pulls it past the helicopter, so he's got a little slack. That's why he went so far past it. Now he's climbing up the ladder. You can see this. I don't even know why I'm narrating. I'm in a punchy kind of movement. I just got hailed on. And so uh, the, the fuel cap, there's two tanks. One's larger than the other one. The one he's going now is the main tank. And uh, when he fills that up, we go around the other side, do the same thing. I don't really need to see that. Um, but he's being really careful not to let water get in there. Come along to this side. Another fuel tank there. Those two fuel tanks are connected underneath with a, a line, so I don't have to switch from one tank to another. And that's really all there is to it. I'm not going to show you the whole thing. It's kind of boring. He's finishing up now. He's going to put the cap on. He's going to line up the white lines on the cap. Let's see if he does it. He's not going to. Yep, he did. The lines are aligned. That means that it's. I usually help them by grabbing the ladder. Let's see if I can do it while I'm making video without scratching up the helicopter. Nope, apparently I can't. Sucked on the skids. I usually try to help them if I can. All right, here we go. Carrying the ladder over for him. He's gonna take it from me because he's a good guy. He probably thinks I'm nuts because I'm making this video. Anyway, he's gonna fuel this side up. He's gonna cap it up. And then he's gonna disconnect everything, put the hose away, and the truck has a pump in it, which is why it's running. So far, it takes 12.6 gallons. And as soon as we start pumping again, that number's gonna change. And I'm waiting in the rain. There it goes. And then whatever it says on the end is what I pay for. And it's a really weird day. Beautiful sun over there. Crazy rain over there. Dried some cherries, and guess what? I'm gonna go out and do them again. That's all there is. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.